Hi everyone, welcome to the Droidy channel. Today's video will explain to you Android phone stuck on Verizon screen. An Android user said on the forum, my Android phone is stuck on the Verizon screen when it starts. I have been using this Android phone since July and this is the first time I have encountered this problem. I don't know what to do, is there any advice that can help me fix Android phone is stuck on Verizon screen? If you are like this Android user, you want to know how to fix Android phone stuck on Verizon screen. Then please be patient and try all the methods in this video. This video is applicable to mobile phone models including Samsung, Huawei, Xiaomi, OnePlus, Vivo, Oppo, Sony, LG, HTC. Various problems may cause Android phone is stuck on Verizon logo. We will list two reasons that may cause this error on your device. 1. Custom root or firmware. If you have rooted or customized firmware on your phone, they may have changed the files on your Android device or there may still be errors. In this case, your Android phone will show an error and cause Android phone won't go past the Verizon screen on startup. 2. Application issues. Some applications may cause Android phone stuck on pink Verizon screen when restarting, which may be caused by applications you recently downloaded on your phone or applications that have not been used for a long time. Now, it is time to know how to fix an Android phone stuck on Verizon logo. Please follow the steps in the video and try the methods in the video one by one. I believe there is always a solution that can solve your problem. If you have any questions, please feel free to comment in the comment area. If you think this video is good, you can subscribe, like or leave a message to let us know which method helped you solve the problem. Method 1 is to hard restart the Android device. One of the easiest ways to solve Android phone gets stuck on Verizon screen during startup is to hard restart the Android device. This is easy to do and works in most cases. A hard restart can eliminate temporary glitches and software glitches. If the problem of Android phone stuck on Verizon screen on boot is due to this, you can solve it by hard restarting. To hard restart an Android device, long press the combination of the phone's force restart key. The combination of the Samsung phone force restart key in the video is the power button and the volume down button. Please press and hold the combination of your phone's force restart key for 10 to 15 seconds. When the phone brand logo appears on the screen, you can let go, and then your phone will automatically restart. Wait for the restart to complete and see if the Android phone gets rid of the Verizon screen. Method 2 is to boot into safe mode. Safe mode only loads the necessary files needed to start the device, and some third-party files or applications will not run in safe mode. If the get stuck on Verizon logo screen on Android phone problem is caused by a third-party application or file, safe mode can troubleshoot this problem. To enter safe mode, follow these steps. First, make sure the Android phone is turned off, then press and hold the power button. When the phone logo appears on the screen, release the power button and press and hold the volume down button. If done correctly, your Android phone should turn on and safe mode will appear in the lower left corner of the screen. If no problems occur in safe mode, it can be determined that a third-party application is conflicting or affecting it. Please delete the suspicious third-party applications one by one and verify the Verizon logo keeps staying on the Android phone screen problem again. Finally, to exit safe mode, restart the Android phone. Method 3 is to wipe the cache partition in recovery mode. During the use of your phone, Android phones will constantly store some files so that you can use it faster, and these files may be stored in the cache partition. But this may happen when the files in the cache partition are damaged or faulty, and the problem of Android phone keeps showing Verizon logo on the boot screen may occur. To troubleshoot the problem of storing files in the cache partition, try to enter the phone into recovery mode and then wipe the cache partition in recovery mode. To wipe the cache partition, connect the phone to the computer, and make sure your phone is turned off and wait for at least 30 seconds. After that, press and hold the volume up button and the power button at the same time until you see the recovery mode screen, and do not let go during this period. Then use the volume down button to select the wipe cache partition option and press the power button to select it. Then use the volume down button again to select yes, and then press the power button again to confirm. After waiting for a few seconds, the option to restart the system immediately will appear. Please press the power button to confirm. Wait for the phone to restart and complete the relevant settings, and see if the Android phone won't turn on past Verizon logo is fixed. Method 4 is to restore factory settings in recovery mode. If none of the above three methods can help you get Android phone out of the Verizon logo screen, then you are left with a factory reset. Factory reset is the solution to most software issues as it will restore your Android device to its factory state. So if you need the data on your Android phone, back it up before doing a factory reset, otherwise you will lose all your data. Next, follow the steps below to put your Android phone into recovery mode to restore it to factory settings. Connect your phone to your computer. Make sure your phone is off and wait for at least 30 seconds. Then press and hold the volume up button and the power button simultaneously until you see the recovery mode screen. 
In Android recovery mode, use the volume down button to select the wipe data slash factory reset option and press the power button to confirm. After that, use the volume down button again to select factory reset and use the power button to select yes option to confirm. The reset process will be triggered and it will take only 2 to 3 seconds to complete. Once completed, it will take you back to the same recovery mode. After that, use the power button to select the reboot system now option. Finally, your Android phone will turn back on and you will need to follow the on-screen prompts to complete the setup. Finally, once everything is done, use your phone normally and check if the problem of Android phone is frozen on the Verizon screen is solved. Method 5 is to go to a service center for help. Usually, the above solution should help you remove stuck Verizon logo from Android phone, but if the above guides do not help you, there may be a hardware or other problem. You need to call or take your phone to a service center for help. See if they can help you solve the stuck on Verizon screen when booting up an Android phone problem. That's all for today's video. If you find this video helpful and think we did a good job, please like and share it and tell us which method helped you solve the problem in the comment area. At the same time, if you think we need to improve, you can also tell us your opinions and suggestions in the comment area. Thank you. Good luck.